Hey, God bless you. Pastor Israel here. And I am excited to announce that Trinity Church will be opening up its in-person services very, very soon. And in fact, in just a few minutes, Pastor David is going to talk a little bit more about that. Now, given the guidelines that have been provided to us by the CDC and our governing officials, uh, we have taken all of that into consideration and we have decided um, as Trinity Church to open up in four phases. And these are what the phases look like. Phase one is the opening up of our in-person services. Um, we understand that we will not be able to give you the perfect situation nor the ideal situation, but we also know that this is only a temporary situation. Uh, phase two involves the reintegration of our life groups uh, that we're meeting on site. Um, this also involves any in-person um, counseling uh, here in our facilities. Phase three is our children's programs. Unfortunately, phase one, we will not be able to provide childcare. We will not be able to provide uh, children's programs. This includes uh, toddlers, uh, Royal Rangers, girls ministry, uh, also tour youth. Uh, but in phase three, our focus will be to reintegrate these programs and provide them for you. This also includes baptisms and uh, baby dedications and any other special um, uh, classes that take place here at Trinity Church. And finally, phase four involves um, the larger activities. This includes uh, weddings on site. This includes funerals and other any other special programs that we may offer on a larger scale. Now, unfortunately, we do not have a timeline for phases two, three, and four, but the good news is we do have a timeline for phase one, and Pastor David is going to talk a little bit more about that. Now, if you do not feel comfortable in uh, coming back right away because maybe you have children, or maybe you live with the elderly, or maybe just uh, you have an uneasiness, we completely understand, and we want to be sensitive to that. Um, and so the good news is, while we have in-person services here uh, very soon, we will also continue to provide you and your entire family with all of the content for you to enjoy online. Well, I'm excited to hear what Pastor David has to say. So now with you to share about phase one, reopening and reintegrating our in-person services, Pastor David Espinoza, Jr. Hi, everybody. Pastor David here. I'm excited to announce, as you just heard from Pastor Israel, that we are uh, entering phase one. And that means that we're going to be starting our services again. Right now, we're looking at June 14th. Um, God willing, we will be able to open that Sunday. Uh, hopefully, we will have all the sanitization, sanitizing materials that we need, as well as the signs that we need. As long as we can do that, God willing, we're going to be opening June 14th. Uh, we're excited, but there's a few things that I want to let you know. We will need you to have masks if you want to come in. Also, we will be practicing social distancing. You will be seated. Uh, we need to tell you where to seat. Also, your temperature will be checked as you come in, and you will be asked a few medical questions. Our services are going to be about 45 minutes. Uh, this is something that we were asked to do by the government. There is limited seating. Uh, we can have 100 at the most on the premises, and we need about 20 people to uh, minister to you. So it'll be about 80 people per service that we can actually uh, let you in. Our service times are going to be 8.30 Spanish, 10.30 and 12.30 English, 2.30 Spanish. We will be sanitizing uh, the church in between services. The doors will be open half hour before we start. All minors are welcome, uh, but there will not be youth or children or toddlers or nursery just yet. We'll be in here together. Um, we're excited about this. Help us keep this in prayer. We love you. We miss you. We're excited to see you. And if you want more information, just go to the link below. God bless you.